Hey, what's up guys? This is Trigger Sad Gamer coming to you with the next part of my Guild Wars 2 Let's Play. Alright, when we last left off, we had realized that we were kind of wrong in our assumption on who it was that was causing the murderous golems to pop up. And now, Zocha appears to have figured out something on her own, as it seems. Or she's going to be assuming something and she is going to try to figure out what's what so how's about we the player start things off okay where's socha around the corner got you oh look <laughs> i love that that's kind of cool looking how about oh, wait no socha first yep 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 socha first if all mink and kepa are guilty of his idiocy then the i've built this golem to highest spec once I activate it, we should see results. Stand by. Good morning, mistress. How may I serve her kill you today? Kill, kill, kill. Okay, there's our proof. Hmm. Deactivating the golem may require... Time to attack. I've got some aggression to work out. Oh, boy. Ow. Oh, crap. I've been blind. So, I was right. Huh. Granny. No one should trust a nice Asura. I hate saying that because it makes me sound mean, but in all honesty, they're, like, they're never ones to be trusted because you never know what they're actually up to. Okay. Come on. Oh, man. This guy is crazy. But still, grannies are grannies. And while she may be a granny, she is not a nice one. It's a power matrix. Whoa there, hun. Son. Pick that up. What's this? Detonate the power matrix to cause an electrical surge, dazing and damaging nearby foes. Okay. There we go. Whoa. Oh, whoa, boy. Ow, 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 ow. Okay, let's knock you down, and boom. <laughs> Alright, uh, let's see. This guy is a bit on the annoying side. Nope. Okay, let's see. Uh, let's try to knock him. No, actually, daze him. Alright. Come on. Come on. And boom. Oh, that's the wrong skill. Weaken. Ow, what the heck was that? Ah, that's a blind. Okay. That is a blind. This is a knockdown, though. Knock back. That's a knockdown. Yep. Okay, come on. Come on. So close! Ah, okay. Well... That settles that. The core that Haya swapped in must contain a hidden exploit to drive the golems to murder. So we're going up against a counselor? No mean task, but I'm ready. I don't care how high up she is, she can't do this to us! No sarcasm this time. Haya's not just smearing Snaff's reputation or mine. She's killing people and framing us for it. We have to take her down in front of the entire council. Let me fire up Mr. Sparkles, and then I'll meet you in the council chambers. Commence operations. Ooh. Where's Sparkles? I like Captain Sparkles. I mean, uh, Mr. Sp uh, Sparkles. So, yeah. Uh, let's see. Where are we supposed to be going? Oh, we're exiting already? Okay, yeah, we are. Where are we heading off to? Oh, that's odd. I don't see the marker on the map. I'm gonna leave the instance and then check. So, yeah. Okay. Where am I going? Oh! I'm still in Ratasum. Okay. Confront Counselor Haya. Oh boy. I'm not good with confrontations. But I will do my best. Seeing as Granny Smith is not someone to be trusted and is murdering everyone. <laughs> okay, let's go now. 
Okay. Oh, there's Socha. And Mr. Sparkles. Yes. Ooh. Kaya, we know you're the one who turned the valet golem into an anti-personnel device. We've got all the proof we need. And we're going to expose your machinations to the entire council. Proof? You mean those blueprints I gave you? The ones my underlings are retrieving from your lab at this very moment? You're not in my lead, dearies. And after my modified valets are finished with my fellow counselors, no one else will be either. You'll get the blame, of course. Nothing personal. This is merely how top-level council politics play out. If it helps, I'd be happy to feign remorse. Let's go, Savant. If the council gets wiped out by your golems, the peacemakers will fry us on sight. We'll have to catch up with Haya later. Good luck, my darlings. Try not to die too painfully. We got work to do. I just hope those oaths on the council are grateful. Oh boy. Whoa. Sparkles, calm down. Let's go. There they are. Stop them before they buttle again. Ballet golems are oh, remarkably no. useful. Wherever did they originate from? No, 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 no. They were a gift from an anonymous donor. Mere toys, of course. But it's nice to be appreciated. I shall now perform a deep cranial massage with my fists. By my ears, take cover. Oh boy. Oh, so many valleys. Ow. Oh boy. This is not going to end well. Okay, come on. Come on. Come on. Let's do this. Oh, no. Let's do this. Ow, ow, ow. Ow. Come on. Oh, yeah. Days in the fu- Oh, wait, wait, wait. What, was, what was that? Oh, it was a branch. No, it was a plant. A potted plant. Plant of the pot variety. I am trying to stop this, you hack. Come on. I'm nigh invincible. Well, it would be awesome, though, if you helped. I mean, I'm pretty sure all of you super smart counselor people have something. Hostiles detected. Initiate combat protocols. How many valley golems are there? God. Oh boy. Okay. Ow. 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 Get the frack away from me. Come on. There we go. Oh, daily kills. Fun. You know what's not fun? Dying. Now, just die, you guys, so I don't have to die. Come on. Come on, buddies. There we go. Let's do that. Let's do this to make you guys a bit less competent. Come on. Okay. The what now? The furrowing. Oh god. Your counselor guys. Mm -mm. You guys sure are the strict bunch. Okay. Hardcore. Protocols active. Restricted weaponry unlocked. Prepare for death. Have a nice uh, Kill the ads, kill the ads, kill the ads. Or, you know, try not to die. Wait, please. Let's knock you down. Non sparkles. Treat them treat just like rock them, sock them robots. Rock them and sock them. Oh, crap. Fire. No, 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 no. Let's do that kind of wish that wave actually damaged instead of just crippled. That would be amazing. Come on. Come on. Okay. Here we go. You look weary, master. Let me give you a massage. No. Can rest forever. I'm sure no one wants that. Uh, no one wants that at all. Do not worry, ah, master. Damn it. I have detailed files on blood stain removal. You'll soon oh. Not really something I would like to hear. Zosha. 
For once I'm glad to see you. And is that the snaff savant? What is the meaning of this? Those valet golems were based on my designs. Counselor Haya tampered with them and sent them to kill as much of the council as possible. I can vouch for this. Haya is making a power play. We don't have hard evidence, but... Say no more. Bold moves are Haya's style, and she never leaves evidence that can be traced back to her. Leave Haya to us. We'll keep an eye on her. She may well receive a lethal gift of her own someday soon. In the meantime, you have our thanks. Well, it's not a complete victory, but we did save the Arcane Council and Snaff's reputation. I'm sincerely sorry I ever doubted you. I accept your apology, again. Just remember, I'm the Snaff Savant. Sarcasm aside, you can count on me to live up to his example. I knew I'd achieve this. <laughs> oh, I love the Asura. Okay, let's see what... Ooh, new armor. I just realized I never upgraded this guy. Let's see. Precision, power, I'll go with vitality. Completion leads to satisfaction. And then transmute this stuff later. Okay, ooh, I can search this guy. Uh, and a mask. It's for rangers. <laughs> Fun. Maybe let's talk with Searcher one more time. High is powerful and wealthy, but even her uh, resources are finite. She really made a run of this crazy mess, didn't she? She'll get hers. I'm putting my money on another council member doing her in. That might just happen. The counselors do a lot of back and forth sabotage. We'll have to wait and see. Wow. That's just Wow. <laughs> Alright. Salutations. Next time I'll bake Haya cookies with a bomb in them. Okay. What about My you? Time is limited. Not a bad plan on Haya's part, except where you came in, Savant. Aw. What thank is it? you. You can stop talking to me now. Council okay. was in session. Blast it, Haya. When she thinks she's safe, and that's when I'll strike with stealth golems or poison mushrooms. Oh, fun. <laughs> I'm glad I'm not a part of the counselor. Council. Oh, no drops? No drops. Okay. Read Socha's letter. I think I'll save that for another day, since that's for a level 22 quest. I, however, realized that I haven't finished exploring Radasum, as it seems. I still have a couple of areas that I need to go out and explore. I doubt it'll be anywhere important, but it seems it's all of the outer areas of the... I brought us soon. Uh, let's see. I explored my home instance. Right? I don't even think there is a point of interest in there. So, for the purposes of this, I think we'll go and head out to the dock area. Because I know that's definitely a place where I, I haven't explored fairly well. Yeah, Rod assume while being so high up it really isn't that large of an area and i'm sorry for not uh doing all of this in a single video i honestly don't know what i was thinking um maybe i'll revisit this area on a single player i mean on a, on a player that isn't dagnet and maybe and i'll just do a whole run of the city in one go but yeah anyway let's head on to that's metrical providence and the idea incubation one. And I know I definitely need to uh, work on. Ooh, what's this? That's a weather generating machine. Oh, that's not cool. Interesting. Um, I know I definitely have to do something about uh, the Silvari home area. I mean the grove, what am I saying? Because I did record a full exploration Step video of that. Back, citizen. This area is off limits. Okay. Um, I did do a video of Morgan D exploring the entirety of the grove, but I'm, like really late, early on in the Let's Play. But unfortunately, Fraps being Fraps, it didn't record properly, and none of the files were actually usable. 
So, yeah. Not fun. But I digress. I think I need to go to Downside Quay next. Okay. Ooh, I got one already. I know for a fact that I have to go up. Since all this it was... Um, it was just a, you know, a point of interest. I don't like this part. Just because of those inquest researchers that have a lab up here. Ugh. Okay, that's another point of interest down. And a waypoint. I can't necessarily say... I don't know, I just don't like the inquest. They're annoying as hell. I think they're better than everyone else. Stealing ideas, inventions, claiming that they're amazing when, when let's just face it, they're the inquest. They are not so hot. Anyway, the there I think there are only a couple vistas in Radasum, and this is gonna be the last one. Just go inside the ship, do a hop, a skip, a jump. Okay, now most people would probably assume that you can just get it from up here, but no, this jump is, for any character actually, it's too uh, high. You go on the back, and there is going to be a box just hanging out for some reason. And yeah, you're good. Okay. <laughs> Where is map completion? I should have a box on top of the map. Wait. Oh, fun. I'm missing a vista. Where? I mean, another vista point of interest. Where is it? Ah. Uh, it's not here. It's not in your home instance. That's definite. Oh, your home instance. Oh, there is one in your home instance. It's just not. Here's an odd thing that I really don't understand. You have names for areas in Radasum that you can't actually access. There's Riven Valley, the Polymach Arena, which is in of itself a completely different case. This advanced Meta Mystics Lab and the Arken or Arkentic uh, Valley and the Magus Valley. Like what are these areas for specifically? Because I know for a fact that the grove doesn't have random area names on them. So what I'm going to assume is that this was supposed to be a much larger city. But ArenaNet decided not to finish it for whatever reason. Or maybe add like different parts to it later on. And the same with the other home cities, but we just don't actually see those, because they're a little bit ways off. I don't know. I'm just snowballing here. But yeah, I think I know where the last one is, which is kind of annoying seeing as we were just there. I think we've been there multiple times, too. I guess the game just doesn't register the point of interest while in it, so yeah. There we go. And since this is in a uh, personal instance, we'll have to leave. Now we can go in through the portal, or we can do the fun way. <laughs> that was supposed to teleport you out. I don't know why it didn't do that. <laughs> oh, what the hell was that? That was so weird. It should have... It should have teleported you out of the instance. Because you can do that in the grove. Oh, well. Let's just grab our prize. Three tea stones. Sweet. Uh, let's show the mechanic off since I got a new armor piece. What you do is you grab a tea stone. You double click it. You'll end up with this weird window here. You place the armor you want to have stats for. And then the armor you want the appearance for. Now this can go either way. If you want, you don't actually have to like put them in that specific order. You can have the look here, the stats here. It doesn't matter. All, as long as you can click the 
here and then you can click the stats and you're fine seriously it's it's literally that simple a lot of people don't seem to understand that for whatever reason uh, recognition but yeah you almost you saw dagnet shirtless for a second there oddly enough it used to like for a while you actually had to remove the armor piece that you wanted to upgrade in order to transmute it but uh, it went back to the way it was in the beta recently in that you could have the item on you and then you can just like do the transmutation simply simple as that still don't I still don't see the thought process behind why they decided not to do that seeing as they would just added a bit of extra unnecessary time but yeah let's wait how much time do I have left six minutes I don't I don't think I have any t much time to actually do something with this extra time I have several days planned to stop let's see yes. could you attempt to acquire a copy of the unexpurgated journals of Ula for me I misplaced my copy and my collection mm. just isn't complete without it yeah I don't know what to do I think I might just cut it short here then sorry guys if you were expecting anything else besides me wandering around right assume but I can't really move on with the personal story because that's actually a whole new story in and of itself but yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this little step into Dagnet's personal story. Next time, I believe, we'll be going into Tessa's story and seeing what is going on with her. I hope you stick around for that. See you guys.